What's up? Today we will have this tutorial on how to color a sketch. Let's go. Let's start. Open your scanned sketch or drawing. For this tutorial we just need a multiply blending mode. You can notice that my sketch is a little bit not clear. So in order to darken the line art we just need to duplicate the layer and set the upper layer to multiply. Before coloring, try to clean up all the edges and background of your scanned sketches. Now, open your ready-made color palette. This can help you easily pick colors for your digital art. Now you're all set. Let's start the coloring process. Add a layer above your sketch or drawing. Again, set this layer to multiply. Multiply blending mode allows you to darken all the elements or drawing underneath the layer. This blending mode allows you to color directly on your sketch. You can notice that the color just darkened the sketch and doesn't affect the line art. This is the magic of the multiply blending mode. Just simply color up your sketch with any brush that you prefer. Now let's enjoy watching the coloring process. If you have any suggestions or questions about Autodesk Sketchbook, just leave a comment. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe to my YouTube channel, thank you. Now for the last step, we need to add some shadows in our digital art. Again, add another layer, and set the color mode to multiply. Just click the Alt key on your keyboard, and pick the color of the area that you think needs to add the shadows. Again, this technique allows you to just darken some areas of your drawing. Later, you can adjust the value of this layer by lowering the opacity. Thank you for watching, enjoy the rest of the time lapse video of this digital art, keep on making art.